guys, Mardi Gras Man 2-3, and today we're going to bring to you a haul. I've already cut this open, and we're going to blame this box on Brixar. I've been waiting on this for a little over a week, and i got to tell you, I stumbled upon this by accident. Uh, he did a video, and he used a 50th anniversary torso, and so I went on eBay just kind of stumbling around, just seeing how much that torso was. It's a pretty cool torso, torso. and I came across this set. Now, this set... Is on my one not I shouldn't say it's on my one list it's not even on my one list because it's obviously retired and the aftermarket price is pretty high on it and this deal is almost too good to be true I mean I got this for such a great price that I'm worried that it's not Lego that it's um it's just not Lego bricks because I couldn't see in the pictures but the instructions were obviously the right instructions, so you can see here, you got any guesses what that is? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this on the tripod, I'm going to unpack it, and then I'll show it to you, because it looks like it's partially built. It was all built up in the picture, so let's see. Alright guys, so this might be one of the best packaged packages I've ever got in. So the, when he says it's partially assembled, it looks like all he did was wrap it up. I mean, look at this. It's wrapped up in bubble wrap. And this is going to take me a while to unpack. So, all right, guys. So I got it all unpackaged, and I got to tell you, this is one of the best packaging jobs I've ever received from any reseller. What he did was he put all of the he listed it as uh, he was going to ship it um, partially built. So what he did was he put all of the individual elements in baggies like this, and then he wrapped them in bubble tape and and bubble wrap, I should say, and taped it up, and it was really pretty secure. So. You know, like this is the gas station. And so that should be most of the pieces to the gas station. And it looks like there's some more right here. So these two bags make up the gas station. And then we got the cinema over there. And then back there we have the church. And then I've already actually unbagged these pieces because they were... Here's the car and the, the old gas truck. Um, the fountain. And here is the rare gold 2 by 2 bricks. Uh, if you could, if it'll focus on that. But I really wasn't even looking for this set. Uh, Bricksaw had, like I said, had done a video. He showed a 50th anniversary torso, which I thought was a really cool tor torso. So I went online on eBay just to kind of get a feel for that torso and see how much it was going for on the aftermarket. And I stumbled across this because it's a 50th anniversary set. And if you guys haven't figured it out yet, look, here's the. It, this even came with the instruction booklet. Which I think if you was to buy just the instruction booklet, you'd pretty you'd pay a pretty nice penny for for that if you wanted to try to piece this set together. It's two books, set one zero one eight four. This set has I think it's close to two thousand pieces. I know it's over fifteen hundred pieces, and I think the original retail was one forty nine ninety nine. And one of the reasons I never really looked for this was because it's pretty pricey on the aftermarket, and um. So it's not really ever been on my want list because I didn't think I would ever going to get it for the price that I was willing to pay. But lo and behold, looking for that torso at uh, 50th anniversary, this comes up. And when I saw the price, the guy had it at a buy it now. And it was, I thought it was too good to be true. So I looked at the pictures for, I mean, he had great pictures. I think he had 10 pictures and I kept looking at them, kept looking at them. And everything looked good except for I couldn't really see any of the Lego logos on the top of the the bricks. So I was a little nervous that he pieced this together with non-Lego bricks. But the more I started looking at it, the more I, I realized how hard it would be to piece this together with pe parts that weren't Lego. So it had to be a resale of the original. And what sold me on it was that he had the original instruction booklets here. So I decided to go ahead and pull the trigger, and I think regular retail on this was $150, and that was 10 years ago, so this set would probably be easily $200 nowadays. And um, he had it at a buy it now with shipping, I think it was $130, and I think he had $20 shipping on it. So, I mean, that is an outstanding price that I got this for. I mean, I couldn't believe it. So I went ahead and pulled the trigger on it, guys, and I've been waiting over a week for it. Um, came in a big box. I really thought it was going to be disassembled more than this, but I, to my surprise, and like I said, each baggie has different parts in it. So I can take this bag right here, 
You see the, uh, that's the cinema. I mean, how cool is that, guys? How cool is that? So I can take this, tear this apart, look for it in the instructions, and then I can rebuild the cinema, and I can find, I don't have to mix it all up and rebuild it. So, I mean, this, like I said, great job in shipping. I really appreciate that. I think it was an antique, niche for antiques or something like that. I looked at his other listings. He had one other, one or two other Lego listings, but doesn't look like that's his main deal. I mean, we got the church back here, which is really, really cool. And I know these buildings are uh, pretty much facades, but they're really, really cool. So, so yeah, that's it for this one, guys. Like I said, do you have this set? Do you want this set? I mean, I just think I got a fantastic deal on it. So leave me some comments below. Tell me what you think. Um, let's see. There is the picture of the set. That's what the box looks like, actually. Like I said, it got a little reflection there. But 10184, that's all there is in this, in this uh, um, hall. You can see this set was from 2008. It was 50th year anniversary from 1958 right there. So, yeah, this was from 50 Years of Bricks. So leave me some comments below. Tell me what you think about the set. Tell me if you like the set. Tell me if you want the set. I think it's a really, really cool set. So I'm ecstatic to have it. Can't wait to start rebuilding the components one by one. Um, so yeah, I know I went on a little bit for this one, but I really like this set. So leave me some comments below. Appreciate all the support. Subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, like the video. Check out all my playlist. And that's it for this one, guys. Can't thank you enough. Appreciate all the support. And we'll see you in the next one.